Okay, and as he loaded a, a knee, I'm going to hit him on the way up. Just loose, guys. It doesn't have to be this. Oh, I'm, I don't have leverage because it has to be this. I just go boom. And I go boom and I come up under his chin. Mm. World War II combatives, the chin jab, Fairbairn Sykes. But the point is, like, to get a good uppercut, I don't have to be way here. As he grabs me, yeah, yeah, so do it a little bit faster and go here. Boom. Mm. Okay, okay, let me try here. Nice. So he grabs and he's going to charge that. Because usually if you throw a good knee, you want your um, ball, your foot on the ground, and point sharp. You're never going to knee someone like ding, 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 ding. Don't, don't be lazy in training. Even if we throw light, you're going to be loading it. Okay? So he grabs me as he goes there. I'm going to give him this uppercut here on the way up. But it could be halfway <laughs> over loose. Yeah, so towards the right one point. If I wanted to fall and fall on a mound or got ugly and it happened, in a sporting aspect, okay. But I mean, that guy's probably not gonna like like this is good if there's like, you know, three guys. And the tall guy thinks he's a kickboxer and he comes up and he goes, oh shit. Okay? So you're a bad guy. You're a bad guy. Come on, slap you guys, you're over there. And he comes up and right away he starts throwing hands and you're like, yeah, like a clinch. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, you got to knock glasses off. I missed your nose perfectly. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't, you're not off. supposed to have your glasses on. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, if you want to try it, just slowly be careful. Sorry about that. 